Uh, fellow Kenyans and the friends of Kenya, I think uh, that's the best way to observe all protocols, I think. Uh, um, when, when you invite an extra to come and address you, uh, uh, expect that they'll say something about Strathmore. And I know the history of Strathmore hasn't been written, and it will be written, uh, I understand it's being written by uh, Silvano Baruso and maybe Professor Spalling. But uh, for those of you uh, who are not born in 1961, that's when Strathmore was founded. And it was the first Mount Ethnic and Mount Ratio. Uh, college, you know, in this country. And it face, uh, the founders face the usual problems of colonial apartheid system. They had difficulties getting the land. They got it from the Bishop of Nairobi, uh, who had, of course, some land. And <laughs> And uh, so in 61, uh, that's when Strathmore started. I got there in 66, five years later. And I, before I got to, to uh, Strathmore in 1965, I was interviewed by Professor Sparling and Martin Drakkard. Uh, they drove to, to interview me in the middle of nowhere, that is Kitui. Um, in a Ford Anglia, I don't know how they got there, but <laughs> the roads weren't tarmacked then. Um, and when I got to, to Strathmore, um, for the first time in my life, I met the face of Kenya. Because um, in Kitui, uh, I hardly had classmates who are campus, but at Strathmore I met Luos, uh, Kikuyus, um, uh, Indians, and Jungus as well. <laughs> so it was, uh, you know, Mount, you know, Mount ethnic. And of the three uh, of my teachers and mentors, there are two at Strathmore, though in their seventies, Professor Sparling, uh, Silvano Baruso who I took to my village to climb, you know, a sacred rock, and he did it. And uh, Professor uh, Ryan, Terry Ryan, who taught me economics at Strathmore before, you know, going to, um, uh, to the University of Nairobi. But there will be more stories about uh, Strathmore uh, when you read um, a biography which is being done by me and some young brilliant journalist is called um, Inspiring Encounters and I'm just waiting the appetite of uh, the Strathmore University Press 